All right, guys, we are at the Shrine of Remembrance, as you guys can see here. Quite busy today. It's a Wednesday <clears throat> afternoon. We just finished lunch and uh, oh, I got a few police up there. Um, we got Anna over here. Hello. <laughs> Do you like this place? What's your thoughts on the shrine? <laughs> What's your thoughts? This is not a photo. Oh. <laughs> What's your thought on the shrine? It's so good for the people who made the, the thing to remember of the people who fighting for the yeah. country. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. It's a beautiful place. A lot of people up there checking out the view. So we might do that very, very soon as well. We'll go further in and check it out. A lot of tour groups over here, guys. A lot of tour groups. And uh, it's another beautiful day, guys. Another beautiful day. This is the beautiful grounds of the shrine with the buildings over there. A lot of uh, office buildings in that direction. And, uh, but yeah, just generally, it's a very beautiful part of, of the city, guys. Very, very well maintained. And uh, we're gonna go here and check out the visitor center. I'm not sure if I can film in here. I'll try, I'll try my best. I'm pretty sure you can, but we're gonna go into the visitor center now and uh, check out what's inside here. Let's have a look. of you guys from the sanctuary area lovely lovely view we're gonna go up to the balcony now and check out the balcony which is supposed to be even better views from up there i haven't been here for a good probably 10 years or so so yeah it's nice to get up here and check it out Views from the balcony guys up here absolutely beautiful view especially if it's a nice day like this Jesus, look at that. Probably one of the best views you'll get in Melbourne for free, I reckon. So, your first time catching the tram over here. What was your thoughts? I don't like the tram. You don't like the tram? Wow. Why don't you like the tram? It's crazy. Crazy? And busy. And busy. Wow, okay. Anna's not a tram girl, guys. Oh, well. She's, it's an icon of Melbourne, guys, but... I guess she's not a tram girl. <laughs> I'm not a tram guy either myself. It's not not that into it. But it does get busy over here in the free tram zone. So you prefer the train, right? <laughs> okay, fair enough. So yeah guys, Melbourne skyline, probably the best view of Melbourne you will get for free. Um, what's that? the face on the building oh right down there I'm not sure that's a good question I got no idea <laughs> yeah no doubt guys the best view you're gonna get in Melbourne for free the next best one obviously Eureka Sky Deck but you got to pay to get in but here it's completely free so this is really a positive for me this is probably the highlight of coming here absolutely beautiful Moomba Festival guys, 2023. I haven't been to Moomba in I don't even know how long. I don't even know how long, like it's been years. So it's gonna be interesting to see what Moomba is gonna be like here with, uh, with Anna, beautiful Anna. And uh, we're gonna take a walk around. These are some of the carnival rides. So it's a Thursday today, we're here on the opening day. And we're gonna see uh, what the crowds are going to be like, what sort of activities are on offer. 
So this should be one of the more quieter days. So a oh, bit of music guys, we'll let you we'll let you go. We'll talk to you soon. And what that really just means is let's look after each other and let's look after this country. So thanks to you all, thanks for your respect and have a great time here at Moomba. So thank you. Maybe we're going up, up, up. Ten dollars for one round. I think it's one round. I'm not too sure. Wow, look at this view, guys. MCG precinct, sporting precinct over there. Pretty beautiful. And then the city skyline in the back. It's a beautiful day, guys. You having a good time, baby? Yeah, good time. We just went on the Ferris wheel. Did you enjoy that? Yeah, and you got homemade sushi. Look at that. Let's look at this sushi. What's inside there? Can you explain to my subscriber what's inside? Crab stick. Crab stick and and is that all? Mayo. And mayo. Crab stick and mayo. Homemade sushi. So good. And I've got. Uh, I've already started, guys. I was hungry, but I got wood fired pizza. Forty eight hours. I think it's called or forty eight H, whatever it's called. Very very good. We highly recommend. It. And uh, yeah, we've got some ski water show on the end there, and we're just having a having a quick dinner, a quick bite to eat. Beautiful setup over here, guys. This is in the uh, Alexandria Gardens or Alexandra Gardens, something like that. I forgot which one it is, but uh, yeah, beautiful palm trees, beautiful palm trees, and lots of rides for the uh, the family and stuff like that. A lot of good stuff. Generate all of that speed. Through the wakes, competing against the boys as well. Lara Buck up over the top. Oh. A solid fucking jump. So I hope you enjoyed that final footage from um, Melbourne, the Moomba Festival, the Shrine of Remembrance. Um, it was some good footage and uh, I feel like Anna definitely enjoyed herself um, while she was here in Melbourne, guys. Um, that is going to be a wrap for this trip in Australia for Anna and I. Uh, I wanted to let you guys know the next time you will see us. We will be back in the land of smiles, baby. Land of smiles, Thailand. We will be back in the next video, guys. So stay tuned for our Thailand videos. I am so excited to be back uh, in Thailand very, very soon. And, um, you know, every time I, I get away from Thailand, I always miss it, man. I always miss it regardless. Um, it's like my second home, you know what I mean? In some cases, it does feel like my home sometimes, especially the last few years where I've spent the majority of the last two years in Thailand. So it's felt more like a home for me the last few years, but um, boy, am I excited to get back to Thailand. Um, obviously, it's gonna be the hottest time of year. It's gonna be very interesting uh, to see what Thailand is like now after hearing all of the stories, how busy it is, how crazy it is in the major, uh, tourist areas like Bangkok and Pattaya and Phuket. So looking forward to checking some of those places out, obviously seeing Anna's family again and uh, seeing the lovely dogs there because I've got some, some, some of my best friends over there, man. <laughs> my best pals there. But uh, also, of course, Songkran, Thai New Year, the water festival. Um, they haven't had this for a few years now, the water festival, because of obviously the COVID stuff. So 
this year is back and I'm very very excited because the last few years I was in Thailand they didn't have it um, so this year I couldn't miss it man so we're going to be in Thailand for Songkran for my first Songkran first proper Songkran you know what I mean with the water festival so I'm very very excited for that to see that stuff and um, let me know what you guys think if you've ever been to Songkran let me know your experience I'd love to hear your experiences and um, I'm just looking forward to checking it out for the first time but guys it's been one hell of a ride here in Australia for Anna's first trip uh, first time here definitely a lot of ups and downs but uh, it was definitely well worth the visit and of course we will be back in Australia in a few months but we are going back to Thailand guys so expect some more Thailand videos very very soon the next time you see us will be in Thailand guys so Thank you so much for watching these uh, latest videos from Australia. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, please make sure to like this video, leave a comment, and be sure to subscribe to this channel for upcoming videos in the future. And uh, as well as clicking on the notification bell to be notified of any upcoming videos as well. The end of this video, guys, stay tuned because I will be putting up the fireworks from Mumbai. It was definitely some lovely, lovely fireworks. And uh, I think it's worth the wait, guys. And I think it's worth checking out. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm very, very grateful for your time. God is good. Let the journey continue. We will see you in Thailand, guys. Yeah.